This is your Spirit News Network with your 8 a.m. report, where we start the week off with spirit. Featuring your zero Emmy Award winning anchors, Hershey and Mikey. With Donnie in sports, Amandy with your latest entertainment updates, Morty on the latest weather direct from the field, and Siddiqui with tips to keep you up to date on health and wellness. Go Cubs! Good morning, and welcome to the Spirit News Network. I'm Mikey. And I'm Hershey. Good morning, good morning, good morning, Wolfpack. We're here! This is your 8 a.m. report. We have some great news today. We got Mr. Garcia on the show today, uh, the infamous skateboarder. We also want to remind you to stop, click, and subscribe. Below. We're going to go out to the WSB presidents with an important message. Since everyone has done such a great job at showing spirit for our school, we'd like to thank you by giving you all a discount card. We hope you enjoy them. If you haven't received one yet, you will soon. Virtual sidewalk art is coming up soon. More information is on the way. Club Rush starts this week, and this is how to join. You can find Club Rush on Great Oaks webpage under activities. There you will find all the clubs a part of Club Rush this year. Don't be afraid to join them. They're happy to have you. If you don't see one that you like, don't be afraid to start your own club. See you there, Wolfpack. We now have a new segment called Club Spotlight. The first club we will introduce is Black Student Union, so stay tuned for that. For our act of kindness this week, we encourage you to write a letter or send an email to one of your teachers to show them your support. We really want to make sure that the teachers feel loved and appreciated during this time. Hashtag go kind. <laughs> Back to you, Hershey and Mikey. Thank you for that message, WSB. Also remember to check the slides for important information coming out. Next week we have That's Club Rush. week. Where is that sound uh, coming from? My goodness. I apologize. This week, October 5th, we have the Club Rush going on. Make sure that you get involved. Rush, rush, we be clubbing. All right, we're gonna go out to uh, Donnie in sports. Hey, Hershey and Mikey. I'm out here reporting at the uh, Great Oak baseball field. I'm out investigating uh, brown spots. So we're talking about brown spots and, uh, and the quality of fields. And for some reason right now, um, as we can see, this normally would not be acceptable to Mr. Morton as uh, he does not like brown spots on his field. So, uh, you know, it's important that you take good care of your field. And Mr. Morton, if you come out here, you can see that uh, he takes exceptional care of the infield. But for some reason... He's struggling a little with the uh, the sidelines here because he normally would not tolerate brown spots on his field. Um, you know, considering that they are the defending CIF champions for uh, for baseball in Division what four, I believe, uh, you would think that we would not have brown spots on our field, but uh, we're blessed to have a great guy like Mr. Morton running our baseball program because he normally would care about those brown spots. But since he's not here every day, we have brown spots. So anyways, uh, back to you, Hershey and Mikey. Thank you for that report, Donnie. Now we're getting to some, some sports on campus. Just makes you think. We had an actual weather report. This guy might've watered his field. 
right? That would have helped us. 102, 103, 104. Huh. Water. What do you think? Maybe we should just have him post it on Twitter so that he might get the weather report. I hope so. I hope so. Tweet, 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 tweet. Again, congratulations to our baseball team for being CIF champions. Hopefully uh, your coach gets that field back to normal. Now we're gonna go to a commercial break. I got that sunshine in my pocket. Got that good soul in my feet. I feel that hot blood in my body when it drops. Thank you to our sponsors. Uh, Mikey. Yes. Uh, what do you call someone with no body and no nose? I don't know. Nobody knows! All right, Sidewalk Chalk Art, October 19th through the 23rd. Make sure that you submit your masterpiece to Mr. Skaggs. And I heard there's pizza involved. <gasps> also, make sure to check your mail. I heard there's something in there for the Great Oak students. Thank you very much for participating in the Red Wave. I believe it's a card of discounts. Is Carl's Jr. still on there? I don't think so. I don't, King of Carl's. Buy, buy one Western and get one free. <laughs> I'm down. You gotta check your mailbox. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Check it out. <laughs> check it out. <laughs> um, check it out. Okay. Moving on. I am super excited for our Spirit Zone guest today. Stay tuned. Oh, do we have someone special here for you today? Chemistry, physics, earth science teacher. Football, pole vault, life coach, and someone who literally left their mark on campus, Mr. Ryan Garcia. Welcome to the show. Welcome What's to happening? the Spirit Zone. Thank you for having me. Well, hello, 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 Mr. Garcia. <laughs> How we doing? How we hello. doing today? Oh, just living the quarantine dream, you know? All right, all right. Okay, okay. So, well, uh, we start off the Spirit Zone every week with a question. And that first question is, what does spirit mean to you? Um, spirit just, to me, means that uh, it's like uh, the old Beach Boy song, Be True to Your School. Yeah. Oh. And, uh, but, it, you know, so that you can learn the lessons along the way that will help you later in life. So... Um, I think it's all wrapped up in that. I mean, that's probably the, the best way I could say it here at Great Oak <laughs> Spirit. So, so uh, is there any way that you can maybe clarify for our young uh, fans out there who the Beach Boys are? Uh, <laughs> the Beach Boys are probably the all-time best ha harmony group uh, in rock and roll history based, gotcha. out of, based out of here in Southern California. On, right on. The coast, oh. on the coast, of course. Okay. All right. Okay, okay. Um, Mr. Garcia, um, do you uh, believe in science? <laughs> like Michael? Yes, I do. I believe in science, but I have been baptized. <laughs> oh. I, 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 don't, I don't believe that. That's false. That's false. Oh. What's his name? Michael? What, what was that guy's name in Nacho Libre? I don't know. Uh, I can't let, me, let me ask you, if you believe in science, uh, what man of your stature, you know, your build, <laughs> thinks it's a good idea to get on a skateboard? <laughs> oh, hold up, hold up. <laughs> you gotta have them, man. I got my active board here, okay? With my little pinstripe, okay? Pinstripes! So, Do you see so, these at Temecula? You see Temecula and pinstripes? I don't know. <laughs> So is that the same skateboard you were riding on campus? Because that skateboard looked like it left the scene faster than you got up. It can move. I'm not going to lie. Those bearings are really, really well greased. Listen, here's the story, okay? I was just going about my business, riding my skateboard. Nobody's here. It's a ghost town. Hmm. So hmm. not a problem. And I'm in the middle of a trick that I'll do. It's a double, it's an ollie double kick flip. Hmm. 
But the caveat in that is I did it without the wheels spinning. But right in the middle of my trick, I was watching a squirrel walk her little baby squirrel. And one of those dang seagulls swooped down, took up that little baby squirrel. Wow. And I was like, I, I should do something about this. So it, I, I lost my concentration for just a split second. And, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> um, uh, so I know you're trying to do a, a, a turn or a trick, and the it's wheels were turning. It's double kick flip without the wheels turning. It's um, like a knuckleball, like a knuckleball, but on a skateboard. Yeah, yeah, but you still didn't answer the question of, you know, if you believe in science, that guy who is of your stature and your build, should, should you even be on a skateboard? It's action reaction, man. It's a, one of the laws of motion. Action reaction. Hmm. So, I mean, should, should not. So, so is that a yes or is that a no? I mean, I, I, I'm still like not getting an answer to the question. Okay, I'm just going to have to say that, you know, not everybody of my stature is of the athletic persuasion that I am. Hmm. So it's not for everybody. Okay. I'm just going to have to say that. It's not for everybody. I, I do have to admit, once you hit the ground, the action and reaction and you popping up and running to the bathroom was <laughs> real fast. That was really good. Well, you don't want to mess with the bladder, okay? It's very important. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Gotcha. <laughs> Makes sense. Okay. Makes okay. sense. <laughs> so besides, uh, besides all the pain you endured from that, because uh, I'm sure it did not feel good. Were there, were, were there any repercussions uh, for you uh, riding on the skateboard? Um, well, uh, I still can neither, neither confirm or deny that the video that you guys showed is actually me. Mm. So mm. Um, as of now, there's no repercussions other than a very fairly large contusion on my hip. Mm. Okay. Well, I, I think we have some pretty good evidence. I mean, that guy <laughs> was wearing a Raider shirt. Uh, did have Lakers socks on, <laughs> and uh, yeah. So. How about them Lakers? What's up? And go Doyers. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Okay, let's get back. Let's get. Let's focus. Let's focus. Okay. LA, baby. Okay. Uh, so, uh, Mr. Garcia. Uh, oh, here we go. Uh, now he's throwing up gang signs. Oh, here we go. <laughs> you know, we're a family <laughs> show signs. over here. We're a family <laughs> show, and. Uh, Two letters. Well, uh, here we go. Uh, so, Mr. Garcia, we have uh, what we call here the lightning round here in the spirit zone. So, we're going to give you two choices. You got to pick one. You got to pick one. All right. Are you ready? I'm ready. Lakers or Raiders? Lakers. Lakers. Lakers or Raiders? Let me finish the question, sir. Lakers or Raiders? <laughs> it's Lakers first. Uh, okay. For sure, for sure. But then Raiders is a close second. Uh, All Rock or The Rock? <laughs> the Rock, of course. Okay, okay. Chemistry or physics? Oh, that's brutal. I'm going to give it up for physics this year since I... Um, I'm not doing any chemistry classes this year. Well, at least you can create a good lesson on physics and riding skateboards. That's, that'll work. <laughs> uh, Kobe or anybody else? Kobe, for sure, easily. Mm. 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 I mean, in the same uh, in the same conversation is most definitely Magic Johnson and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, and I might even throw LeBron in there if he wins me a championship. Soccer or golf? Golf, for sure. Yeah, yeah soccer is uh, not something I was very good at. <laughs> mm. Okay. Well, I'm not good at golf either, but. <laughs> All right. So we, we appreciate you participating in the lightning round. And, uh, you know, the last segment of our show is your chance just to reach the great Oak students that are out there right now. I know you said, uh, living the life in quarantine. And, you know, we have a lot of students out there that are living that life right now. And, and we know the struggle is real. And we just want you to, uh, you know, you have 30, 30 seconds to say whatever you'd like to the great old uh, student body. 
hopefully brighten up their day. Well, thank you for this opportunity. Should I look right into the camera? I would say, you know, Confucius once said, a bird in hand makes it hard to sneeze. And uh, what I see that to mean is we got to make a plan. We got to have a plan. Um, dream, hope, aspire. Know where you want to go because it will help you in the decisions that you make today. And, um, you know, we don't have any control of our circumstances a lot of times, but we always have control of how we respond to them. And so I just want to remind you, if you don't know where you're going, any road will get you there. So people in your future are depending on you being the best version of yourself today. So make the best of it. And, uh, and, and along the way, just remember, it's a journey. There's going to be ups and downs. And it doesn't matter how many times you fall. It's about bouncing right back up. How many times you get up. So that's all I have to say. And I appreciate the opportunity to say something to this wonderful Wolfpack community. Go Pack. Thank you, Mr. Garcia. We really, uh, really appreciate that message. And you are the true epitome of bouncing right back up. So, uh, <laughs> you know, uh, I'm glad you're doing all right from the, the fall. And uh, just, again, happy to have you on the show. We look forward to seeing you again. Uh, I'm Mikey. And I'm Hershey. And we're out. Remember, Great Oak students, if you see an act of kindness, make sure to reach out. Click the button. Where's that button at? Click. Make sure to click that button for students doing an act of kindness so that we can recognize them. We are now going to go out to Amandi with some entertainment. Good morning, Wolfpack. Back at it again today. Just wondering, how many guinea pigs does it take to make you happy? Two. Uh, oh. And back to you, Hershey and Mikey. Thank you for that entertainment report, Amandi. Also, remember, Great Oak students, because Nice Matters Week ended last week, doesn't mean that we have to stop being nice. You know, Hershey, you're an amazing person. I feel the same way, Mikey. You're great. If you see an act of kindness, remember, to submit that act of kindness to us so that we can recognize that student. We want to know about it. Tell us. You're amazing. You're amazing. joining us on the Spirit News Network. I'm Mikey. And I'm Hershey. Stay spirited, Great Oak. Have a great week. Be kind. Be awesome. You're awesome. You're awesome. Be you. Go big. Oh.